Yesterday was a bad day for your girl. Oh my gosh, I was so down the whole day. I kept trying to figure out, God, what is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? And it was a, a post on Tumblr. He said, growth is uncomfortable. And that's what your girl here is going through. God is just growing me up in so many areas. He's trying to make me the person that he's created to me to be. And I'm loving the lessons, not all the time, but I see the progress that I'm making. And he says to me, even Nick, if you fall 20 times in a day, I prefer that than for you not to make any progress at all. Like you can fall 20 times, but if you're making spiritual progress, that's good. So yesterday I fell 12, 20 times, but I thought I made such good spiritual progress because I woke up today and I just had like this glory moment, just crying, 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 just like, God, I don't understand why I doubt you. You know, you're always there with me. And it was just a little wink from him that yesterday in one of those downfalls, I went to my meditation book, He and I, and the words that I had highlighted there, he said to me, he said, wherever you are, there I am. And that was it. That was my high five from God. Nick, why are you stressing out? You know God is with you. And so less than an hour later, you wouldn't believe, my assistant all the way in the U.S., I'm in Nigeria, she sent me this message saying, Nick, I had a God wink. He said, wherever I am, his presence is there with me. So here I am in Nigeria having that God wink, saying, God, wherever your presence, wherever I am, your presence is here with me. And my assistant all the way in the U.S. having that same conversation with God, you know, and that's just his love for us, you know, and for her to share that with me was his way of letting me know that he's with me too. And so that song, that those words were in a song that I love and just so happened I had to rush out to an early meeting at my kids' school today and I said, I have to exercise even if for five minutes just so I could have some time with God. And that little space of time I had, there was a song that played, Tasha calls, For Your Glory. And it says, God, I want to be where you are. And that just reminded me of a time that I was just driving to work and just singing that song. Like was, I was in such a bad state, you know, I'm crying, crying, crying. God, let me just be where you are. This life is too hard, you know, it's too much for me, too much. And I'm just crying to God in my alone time with him in that car and that drive, singing this Tasha Chakov song that says in the lyric, God, where you, I want to be where you are. I said, I got to be where you are. And I get to my office. And I have a little time out with God. And those words came up, wherever you are, there I am. And that was just him letting me know he saw me in that car. He saw me all emotional and going crazy and saying, Nick, what's the problem? You know, wherever you are, there I am. And so for that song to play again today in that little space of time that I have for that little short run, it was just him reminding me, Nick, my presence is always, always with you. Stop stressing. So even though I felt 20 times yesterday, no problem. Today I'm back up and I'm such stronger, much closer to God. He invited me a special invitation. He said, I want you very close to me. And I said, God, I accept. I'm gonna go closer and closer and closer to you. And that's where I want you guys, just getting closer and closer to God. Just be fully committed to even if you fall in a thousand times, you just keep go, getting back up. You might backslide or whatever. Just keep picking yourself back up and keep being committed to a closer walk with God. And I promise you, He won't disappoint you. He will never leave us, never forsake us.